Hello everybody, my name is Pan Kirian, and welcome back to another anniversary for the Pan Kirian channel. Today we have with you the Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator, and that's my third video I ever uploaded to the channel. Take it away, Leo. Well, as you can tell, Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator is a game to the dead. Over in the stands at the Coliseum, we have two contestants ready to fight. Are we ready to see them battle, or will they die? In our first matchup, we have 1,000 runes versus a lineup of many contestants to fight. In our first match, we have the Table Turner. Beginning in 5, Four, three, two, one, fight! The ruse go in after the table turner. Can the table turner even take out a single ruse? The world may never know. He finally landed hit. Oh, but he's down for the count. What a sad day this was. Truly, the ruse are unstoppable. Next contestant, coming up after this short break. Hello, I'm COVID-19 here. I'm here for Proud Knives. Have you ever wanted to cut your chances of getting COVID-19 down? Well, now you can. Introducing the Virus Chopper 007. With this bad boy, you can slap diseases into another dimension. Or even lead a crusade against germs. It can slice, dice, and even slash all germs. Watch as I erase all germs from this capitalist lemon. Why pay 15 99 for a regular kitchen knife? When you can pay $518.20 in capitalist pig dog money. If you call now, we will give you a free slip to have protection from myself for a whopping 4.20 seconds longer than capitalist spy. Niapaloka, da? Welcome back after that commercial break. The table turner may have put up a good fight, but the tables indeed turned against his favor. You know, he may have been a bad shot against those ruse, but I can guarantee he can at least kill him. One spectator. In this corner, we have a new contestant, Shrek, versus the remaining 903 rules. Five, four, three, two, one, fight. Shrek goes in, he goes in for the kill, but the rules are too much. He falls oh, down no. in three seconds, roughly. The ruse were too many for Shrek, and he got swarmed in a battle of glory. But, you know, this might be a ruse, but I think Shrek has been Shrek. In today's lineup, we have 845 ruse versus one flightless boy. It's your man, Pingu! Today's gonna be a really close game. You know, I feel that Pingu is really powerful here. He has the upper advantage, and the fact that his accuracy is high and his weapon is special. We'll see about that, though. Let's see if the new cannon suffices. Let's battle. Five, four, three, two, one, fight! Pingu goes for the kill, but he just can't make it! I guess I was wrong, Leo. Yeah, you know, Australians, man. Those Australians, man, they just don't like those penguins. Well, what, what, what do you have against Australians? They're just beneath me, man. <laughs> And in this lineup, we have 845 senators from Australia versus one stabbed boy. I don't know. 
I think Caesar's got a really good chance. Given his speed and damage, the Australian Senators really don't seem equipped for this situation. But I bet you they'll sure do a better job than Brutus did. In five, four, three, two, one, fight. The ruse go for it as Caesar Jesus is walking. He does like a chair. You know what to do? Oh. He falls. He falls at the side of the ruse. I get and it looks like the senators are 2 0 versus Caesar. But will he come back for a third season? Who knows? Still, there was no no ruse perished on the battlefield, so there's still 845 ruse on across the board. What are you eating? Because I don't like my job. In today's lineup, we have our good old girl Betsy versus 845 snacks. Despite her appearance and her sluggish movement, I believe her damage and possibly her ability to speed boost may save her in this fight. Five, four, three, two, one, fight. Here they go. The snacks are coming. As Betsy tries to eat as much as possible. She's chopping away. She's eaten so quite a few already. But will she have the stomach for the rest? Betsy may be able to take out two, enough rules so that the next contestant could win. Betsy hasn't tapped out yet. It may look like Betsy is completely demolishing the ruse, but we assure you, this is not the case. It looks like she's towering out here soon. Will she? Soon, she'll be out of energy. Maybe Betsy... And she has fallen asleep. Betsy, why did you get self full? You know, despite her appearance, she's not actually dead. Lizards play dead to try and survive. At least that's what my son told me. After eating so many kangaroos, I believe that tryptophan really got to Betsy, as tryptophan is naturally occurring in kangaroos. Over to you, Leo. Well, you know, my girl Betsy, I trained her myself, but I should have just upped her tryptophan resistance. It wasn't a stat. It was a stat I just neglected. I didn't think it'd be useful. Very foolish mistake when you're fighting against kangaroo. And in our final matchup of the day, we have 758 kangaroos versus... Wait, is that our cameraman Charles? Go Charles! Oh my yeah. god. god, Charles, what are you doing? What do you think you can do? Think of the children, Charles. Think of the children. He's really going at it, Charles. He can he is unstoppable with his laser vision used to adjust cameras usually. He's decided to take out his rage on the ruse. I didn't even realize Charles had this type of power, or else I wouldn't have If I had known Charles had this much power, I would have hired him years ago. Back in my boxing days. Charles is really taking some hits here. I wonder if he can make it out. Hopefully he can, but. Ironside's 2020 to rose colored glasses. You know, I think all that camera carrying really made him powerful. What do you think? Oh, Charles! Charles! I forgot that upon death, Charles summons his a thousand clones of himself. That is an insanely powerful ability going up against only 736 ruse. I believe the true winner is our cameraman by the end of all this. Charles, you're definitely getting a raise.